Hey everyone, welcome back to True Fear Forsaken Souls Part 1 for Part 15, and we find ourselves in the tomb that was hidden inside the cemetery under the house that none of us knew about. Fantastic, or at least nothing that I knew about. Anyway, uh, before I forget, there's a couple of things I do want to have a look at. One is on top of here. It's a, it's a note, I believe. Right. I had a horrible dream. I walked around the house and found a hidden passage. There was a sort of evil temple under our, <laughs> under our house. I know, it's hackneyed as a horror film. But there was something else. A large stone coffin with my name on it. I opened it, and there was something inside. Something so scary, I immediately woke up. My mother's writing. So, she at least did know what was down here. Um, she may have been the only one. Right, and uh, let's have a look at where I put the bishop. I believe it was this one down here, because uh, I'm sure people were pointing this out, but there is a collectible right there. Looks like it could be... Right. Okay. Yeah, well, that, that confirms it. It's, it's definitely Dahlia. Let's take a look. Uh, that'll be this one over here. A cemetery under your house is a cliche, as long as it doesn't happen to you. Someone went through the trouble to build a modern house over an old cemetery. If we entertain for a second the possibility of supernatural, this looks clearly evil. Build a cursed home and lure a family to live there. The Lordius gave us the house for next to nothing, because of our mother. She must have been involved somehow. Is this girl a ghost? Is it our dead sister? I'm sure she's real. And that makes as much sense as a cemetery under our house. Yeah, well, I'm pretty sure she's your, your sister. She died in, in some way, maybe relating to an asylum. Uh, she may or may not be the Antichrist or something like that. Uh, okay. No, oh, yes, that's right, that's right. I'm, I'm reminded now that this is why we need the compass. Uh, I believe it says the same thing for all of them. Right? Okay, fair enough. Right, let's uh, ignore this for the time being, because we haven't got the chess pieces or the compass. Let's take a look at this little door over here, shall we? Okay. Oh. Alright, maybe I don't need the key. Ah! Right, just rip the panel off, and... Uh, oh, there, there are several gears missing, unfortunately. And I need to open the lock? Do I really? What have I got? I've only got three items right now. That's kind of, that's kind of crazy, actually, considering that I had pages and pages for the last, you know, ten videos. Uh... Yeah, okay. I mean, can I pry it open? Probably not. It specifically says gears are missing. I probably need to very specifically find some gears. I'll come back to this. Uh, what about this statue here? I wonder. I wonder, I wonder. What's all this about? Okay. What's this? Held in place by two mounts? There must be a way to unlock them. Uh, oh, hang on. <laughs> that was hidden in plain sight there. I found a wrench. I wonder what that could be used for. Also, we got some um, got some writing here. Can I not use the dictionary with it and like translate like I did before? Oh, hang on, there's a key. Hey, there is. Grandfather's key. Hey, grandfather's key. Okay. What does that mean? <laughs> uh, oh, the garage, the, the the cupboard with that uh, machine with the, the whetstone and everything. I think. Yeah. Okay. Nothing on the top here, no more keys, no? Okay, well, that's fair enough. We are going to have to leave this screen, I think. Um, yeah, let's have a look at this one. Nah, it just says the same thing as the right. Okay, should we move on? I think so. I think there's one more screen we have yet to, uh, we have yet to explore. Let's go. Ooh, okay. Another little hidden object minigame to divulge in a moment, but what did I just write down? Ah... I didn't want to go through his wallet, so I don't even know his name. He was assigned the sale of our house shortly after it was repossessed. Clearly, he never made the sale. He has red on him. That'll be the estate agent, then, that we were kind of spoiled about last time. Uh, let's take a look at him to start with, shall we? Okay, these must be his cards. I think his name was Gary, okay. What did you write down, Gary? Ooh, three or three, nice. Uh, I chased the girl to the abandoned well, but when I reached for her, she turned around. And her face. It was the face of my little Angie, but disfigured. I broke both my legs. I can't get out of here. I hear them in the other room. I can see their shadows on the walls. They're coming for me. Please, help me. The face of my little Angie. Okay. Was she, like, buried here? Is she in the cemetery by any chance? Or maybe the ghosts just kind of linger around the area? Would they send him here on purpose? Well... Definitely. Maybe they just wanted to get rid of him. Weird. This is kind of horrible. Right. 
Oh, hang on, there's something poking out of his jacket, but I don't want to touch him. This is horrible. Okay, uh, that's it. I think that might be it, to be perfectly honest. I can't use anything around him. Can't pick up the cards. What is that? Oh, it's a <laughs> it's a cricket bat. All right, trying to defend himself, I guess. All right, I think I'm done. Uh, okay, let's have a look at the floor. It's cracked. Yeah, there's a huge crack on the floor. Strange. It seems like there's something underneath it. Okay, can we sort of jimmy that up in some way? Hacksaw it? <laughs> no? Oh. Oh, yeah! Is this the well that's in the backyard? Yeah, I think so. Yeah, when I inspected it, it did say, you know, it looks like there's a room underneath, but I couldn't do anything else. But there you go, this is that room. Right, let's take a look at this guy. Nice little statue here. Okay. This book must be opened from somewhere else, so I need to open the cover, do I? Alright. Who are you, anyway? The crow is clearly missing. Right? Do you mean crown? Well, no, obviously not, because the crown's there. Do, was there a crow meant to be perched on his shoulder or something? Um, okay. Wait, hang on. Wait, wait. His hand. It appears the king is supposed to be holding something. Okie dokie. Uh, is it the dagger, by any chance? No? <laughs> the book? You want another one? No, it doesn't seem to work. Okay, we're probably just missing that item. Unless it's meant to be a wrench. Is he an engineer or something? No. <laughs> Never mind. I can't inspect that thing. Okay. Nothing on the floor. Let's take a look at the hidden object minigame, shall we? Okay. What was that? What? Oh, oh. Oh, it's the candle. Right, we're picking up the candle. Let's see. Wait, what was that? Matches? Okay, I can probably combine them. Or, well, I don't know. What's this? This head needs a body. Okay. Ooh, what's this? A lamp plate, okay. Up there? Yeah, I guess so. Oh, but not quite yet, it needs a candle first. Okay, we'll put the candle up there. Right? And then the... It's already lit. Well, it looks like it, anyway. Did someone fall asleep on the piano there? Is that what happened? Okay, now it's properly lit. Let's see if we can put the, the plate back in place. Alright. What's up with this? Looks like the stone was replaced recently. Maybe there's something behind it. Maybe. Maybe. Uh, I guess I don't have whatever it is I need to, uh, to get through it. That's a hammer handle. Right. Oh. Oh, there's another one! Okay, hang on. Do we need to find a couple more then? I guess. So again, that was replaced recently, right. Who's this? I uh, can't inspect you. Okay. Clearly, there was another crystal in here. Oh, these are all for crystal. There's one here. Alright. Oh, I, yeah, okay. That's That's the hammer, isn't it? I get it. Okay, so, yep, got the hammer. I guess that would get through the wall. Right. Ah, that's where a crystal is. Okay. Right. Um, fair enough. Let's collect them. Uh, looks like there's three slots. Do I have to, like, hit that one as well, would it be? Let's see. Let's just put the blue crystal there. No. Okay, that goes there. Would that go there? Yeah, okay. Still looking for one more, though. Where's that gonna be? Hang on. Oh. Oh! Hang on, let's see. Yeah, just like I thought, so I'm gonna have to smash this one as well, aren't I? To get another crystal? Yep. A, uh, a red one or a pink one this time. Okay. And it goes over here. Oh. Hello, what do we got? We've got some glasses, we've got a brush. The brush I'm taking. Oh! This is it! This might be useful! Okay. An archaeological brush. What would I use that for? Oh, I know! I know! Uh, just before you go down the stairs to the basement, to the left, she says something about bones uh, and them being buried there. This is probably the tool we need to uh, to have a look at them. So... Okay. 
Uh, still got the dictionary. There's there's some of this writing in this room. I think there was some in the other one as well, um, but I just I just can't like translate it. So I just want to double check because we you know we we've, we've kept hold of it. it. Provided with the clue last time, but just not this time. What's all this? I wonder. I can't interact with it. Okay. Well, I've got a wrench. I'm not really sure what to do with the wrench, to be honest. Or the hacksaw. Or the dictionary. Or the dagger. But the grandfather key and the archaeological brush, I have an idea. So, let's go over here, I suppose. Because I want to take a look at the stairs. Yeah, over here. Someone here knows where the bones are buried. And that someone might be me in a moment. Right, right, here we go, here we go. Ah. Okay. So that's what that was. It's a cabinet knob. Cabinet knob, okay. Maybe that's for my, uh, my grandfather's little cupboard area. I don't know, let's go inside. I think this needed a key, right? It's, it's gonna be one or the other, right? It's a key. Grandfather's key? Yes, yes, okay. Oh, this is the glass. This is how we make the compass, I bet. So we need to fill that with water, I believe. And there's also a nice little collectible. So there you go, my grandfather. And uh, where is he placed? Over there, by my grandmother. Let's have a look. David, our grandfather. My grandfather and I understood each other very well. He was, or at least tried to be, a simple man. He passed on to me the desire to repair rather than walk away. When my mother died, he suspected everyone, especially everyone on the Lordius estate. He never shared his reasons with me, so I suspected he needed someone to blame. He knew the truth. He, he, he was the one that was so apprehensive all the time and refused us to, you know, going back to the house and everything, right? He knew what was going on. Okay. It probably is the time for alcohol, but apparently not for, for Holly right now. Not when there's things to do. Okay. So... Uh, I can still use this. Maybe there's like another tape or something to find. Uh, that second one was missing. Maybe we need to find that. The magnet. I need to magnetize the uh, the arrow for the compass, whatever that might be. I haven't found that. Unless it's meant to be the wrench. Wait, no, that doesn't seem to work. The dagger? No. Okay. Oh, yeah, you know what? I, I think I know what to do with the cabinet knob. It's uh, not my grandfather's room, but my grandmother's room. Because that was missing a handle. Over here, yeah? This one- oh, what? <laughs> here we go, doing the hidden object minigames yet again! Round two! Let's do it! Or is this round three? I don't know. Right, are we finding car keys or something? Oh, What's this? No, not car keys, but wire cutters. Alright, let's see if we can cut some wire. Or find some scissors, half of scissors. Hang on. Oh. Use them as chopsticks or something? No? It was like there's something inside. Can I cut my way through? No? Can I slice my way through? No, it doesn't seem to work. Okay. Okay, what's this? You oh, right. Okay, the other half of the scissors. Simple as that. Yeah, just place them on top of each other and we've got it fixed. So, uh, maybe the scissors as they're fixed would work. That works. Okay. What's that in there? Oh, it's a key! Alright. Ah, for this I bet. Yeah. The key was conveniently hidden somewhere near. Alright. Oh, is that wire? Yep, razor wire. Okay, well I've got the tools just for that. Is it dumbbell? Okay. What do I use this for? Oh, that's the item? What? Uh, yeah, it is a dumbbell, as I thought. I, and I know she said she wanted to, you know, she needed to lift some weights and everything, but is, is now really the time? How am I going to use that? I don't know. I really, I've actually got no idea. Let's just have a look at this, because I think the, uh, the cabinet knob is going to fit in here. Yep, okay. It had to be, really, didn't it? What's this? Oh, God, it... Finally, we found the fuse. It's only taken us, what, nine videos or something, probably? Ah, oh, man. Okay, so we've got the fuse. Uh, while I'm here, was there anything else that needed doing? The cross. The cross! The wrench. 
<laughs> yes, okay, everything is falling into place, and it was for the cross. We didn't need the nut and the bolt, we needed the cross itself. Why? Why, 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 why? Maybe that's the thing the statue's meant to be holding? That's meant to go in its hand? Don't know. That's the that's most likely thing I can come up with right now, to be honest. Uh, everything else in here, I think, is done. In fact, we can't actually examine anything here, so yeah, I think we're done with this room. Let's go put that fuse in, shall we? It's been so long. We need to finish this off. So, there we are. Hopefully it works. Yeah. On? Yeah? Okay, so that means we've got power to the treehouse, yeah? So does that mean that the, uh, the light bulb would work? <laughs> okay, again. Right, let's check, let's check the light out first. It does look like it's on. Right. So there's... Oh. Oh, it's, it's for that? Yep. Those four strange figures were engraved on a lamp. Each is unique, but they have something in common. Okay. Okay, did the light need to be on for me to sort of note that pattern down? Probably not. But, you know, I've done it now. Uh, okay, let's take a look inside the treehouse again. Uh, sure, okay. So, pretty much how I left it, I think. What we got in here? Oh, we can use the plant now. Oh, yep, yeah, something is buried here, apparently. Light bulb we don't need. Don't need any of that, okay. Up and down there. What's this? Oh, hang on. We have uh, the number two. A two chip. I was wondering about that, actually. I bet that goes in the top right. We didn't actually play with this last time, but now we can examine it. Okay. Oh, man. All right. Uh, let's put that in place. Why would you put it there? Put the two on the two. You mad woman. Okay. So are we missing three more? I guess. Let's see what we can do. Okay, so we don't play with the dartboard anymore. The tools... Oh, this time we take some tools. Yeah, another one. We've got a saw and a sho... Oh, the shovel. The shovel for this. <laughs> I know how this game works. I think my mind's in the right place. Is that another chip? It is. Another number. Number four. And that's it. Just that one. Okay. I guess let's add that. Yeah, okay. So, yeah, I guess I can't move them around to where they're meant to be until I found all the chips. So what do I do with the saw? I mean, there's lots of wood around here, but, you know, structural instability and all that. This? The Russian doll? Really? The Matryoshka doll? Maybe? It's not giving me a prompt, no hints. Let's just try and saw it. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> sure. To find another chip. The eight chip, okay. So that goes there. Oh, and now I can manipulate it. So it's a little slide puzzle. All right, well, this is different. Kind of annoying. I'd never really like these, to be honest. Uh, they're okay. Um, but they're always, at best, okay, you know? Uh, okay, so we're missing nine, funnily enough. Okay, yep, that's so it's, it's okay. All right, Professor Layton, you're going to be needed. Okay, that was actually nowhere near as bad as I thought it was going to be. There you go. All right, so is that a compass? It's a bloody compass. But we don't take the compass. We just take the fucking needle, the arrow. What's wrong with it? I guess it's it must be broken. But well, we just ripped this right off, so I guess it is. There was a sort of evil temple under our, <laughs> under our house. Hey, there is. Grandfather's key. Hey, grandfather's key. Okay. What does that mean? <laughs> right? And then the... It's already lit. Well, it looks like it anyway. Over here, yeah? This one... Oh, what? <laughs> yep, okay. It had to be, really, didn't it? What's this? Oh, God, it... Finally, we found the fuse! So does that mean that the, uh, the light bulb would work? Okay, again. Uh, let's put that in place. 
Why would you put it there? Put the two on the two, you mad woman.